Hello, welcome back in the series of Applied Machine Learning in Python and today we are here with the quiz of module 2. So minimum grade percentage to pass the exam is 80%. So you can see that I got around 87.27% and let's see I'll give one more attempt. So here is the first question. After training a risk regression model, training and test site accuracies are at 0.98 and 0.54 respectively. So you have to find next best risk regression model. When train score is near about 1 and test score is less then it is condition of overfitting. So for that we have to increase our alpha value. So option is B. So in second question, after training a radial basis function, kernel support vector machine to increase the influence of each uh, training point and to simplify the decision surface the value of c parameter and gamma should be decreased for next best rbf support vector machine in question 3 it is asking about multi class classification so multi class classification is nothing but classification with multiple levels in question 4 it is asking about best score for generalization so in this we have to find lambda value visualization we can see that the training and test set has good score at lambda value of 10 Next question, parsimonious model. So for uh, parsimonious model in that uh, predictor variable are few and best choice for that is uh, lasso regression. In this support vector machine margins are given in three plots and we have to find C parameters. So higher the value of C lesser regularization and lesser the value of C it will be higher the regularization. So option is 1. Here we have to understand the figure A and figure B uh, to attempt the remaining 7th, 8th, 9th and 10th question. Both figures have alpha value in x axis and r square in corresponding y axis.
सो क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवन वी हैव टू डिटरमाइन हुई लीनियर मॉडल इज फिगर इज सो यू कैन से दैट फिगर ए इज रिज रिग्रेशन एंड फिगर बी इज लासो रिग्रेशन In question eight, we have to answer the alpha value where optimize the R square value for ridge regression from figure A and figure B. Okay. In question nine, same alpha value we have to answer for Lasso regression. Now come to last question. Which of the following is true of cross validation? It fits multiple models on different split of data. It also increases generalization ability and computational complexity. I will submit my quiz. So I got increased with two percent from my previous attempt. Now my score grade is eighty nine point zero nine percent. Let's check which one is incorrect.
so here you can see that question 10th is uh, incorrect and question 11th is uh, 80 percent correct and 20 percent incorrect if video is helpful for you then please like and subscribe my channel thank you